please welcome Bioneers Indigeneity Program Director, Kara Romero. Hi, good morning, Bioneers. My name is Kara Romero. I'm from the Chimwevi Valley Indian Reservation in Southern California, deep in the heart of the Mojave Desert. I live in uh, Santa Fe, New Mexico with the Satellite Bioneers Office. In addition to directing the Indigeneity program for the past five years, I'm also a mother of three, a wife, and an artist. I've worked on the Bioneers stage art for three years now, in addition to my other responsibilities not because it's part of my job, but because I love to make art and because my family loves to make art. Together, my husband Diego, a world famous Cochiti Pueblo potter, my brother Mateo, a world famous Cochiti Pueblo painter, my son Santiago, an emerging and established Cochiti Pueblo ceramic sculptor, and myself, a fine art photographer from Chimwevi, form a collective of artists called Romero Art Projects. We work together to support each other in the arts, in sobriety, and in mentoring many other Native youth artists in the Santa Fe area. The artwork, the butterflies you see on stage today were hand painted by my family, Romero Art Projects. <laughs> as well as three young Native artists, one Daniel McCoy Jr. from Muscogee Creek Nation, George Alexander from Muscogee Creek Nation, as well as Del Kerfman from Crow Agency Montana. All of us are living, working artists in the Santa Fe area, and we are all alumni of the Institute of American Indian Arts. <laughs> this year I wanted to paint butterflies. Butterflies because they indicate the health of our ecosystems, which we as pioneers and indigenous peoples are working together to protect and revitalize for all living things that cannot speak for themselves. These butterflies, as wild little pollinators, were also chosen to represent all of you, a kaleidoscope of wild little idea pollinators, collectively migrating up to the Bioneers Conference. I whittled it down to six designs. They come from all of our tribes represented and were borrowed from ancient Pueblo pottery designs, chimwavy basket designs, and beadwork vocabulary passed down through our lineage. The pieces are cut from recycled material and hand-painted. Each one of them are now on sale at the silent auction just inside the entrance to the exhibit hall. I encourage you today to go bid on them, to support the artists, to support pioneers, and of course, to support the continuation of arts education. Thank you so much.